Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, in April of this year, I posted letting you know that Windows 11 24H2, which is this year's annual feature update, could block using no at thank you dot com to bypass sign in into Windows 11 24H2 using a Microsoft account. Now, we also looked at a workaround, and I'll leave that video in the end screen if you would be interested. Now, just to let you know that it seems now that this is going to be the case with Windows 11 24H2 because Zach Bowden from Windows Central has posted recently over on X, and this is just a little video clip that's been posted, and he has said that it looks like Microsoft has blocked the bypass that allowed you to create a local account during Windows 11 setup by typing in a blocked email address. Now it just loops you back, to, as we can see, to typing in a different account. And he tried a, diff a couple of those different and um, blocked email address addresses, which include, as mentioned, um, no at thank you dot com. Another one is a at a dot com. And obviously another popular choice is example at example dot com. Now those don't work anymore. So it seems now that Microsoft is clamping down further now and Windows 11 24H2 will not let you use those so-called uh, fake or blocked email addresses to bypass using a Microsoft account. And what it does is um, it forces you obviously with this new kind of um, setup now in the OOBE out-of-box experiences forces you to type in a working Microsoft account email address and password. But the good news is is you can still type OOBE backslash bypass NRO, as I have mentioned um, in that previous video, into command prompt during the Windows 11 setup experience, during the out-of-box experience, which will let you skip connecting to the internet and basically, um, obviously by extension, linking a Microsoft account. So just wanted to keep you guys in the loop because I know that this has caused a bit of debate. And this has been a popular way to get around using a Microsoft account and using Windows with a local account. And it seems now that those fake and blocked email addresses now, those options will be removed in 24H2. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.